How's it going guys? So I'm doing this video today as a bit of a shout out to the yellow vests. They've been going for about 10 weeks now over in France and they're making a bit of headway though, forcing the government to capitulate on things that they said they wouldn't, getting rid of taxes, um, you know, on petrol and raising minimum wage and, and other things. But what they really want is to, to leave the EU and the other thing that they want really really want is referendums so publicly uh, initiated referendums where citizens vote to decide on policies and to oust MPs if they're not doing their job even oust the Prime Minister if he's not doing a job so that that's what these guys want and that sort of mindset that those sort of um, desires and requests have come over to Australia now and there is a yellow vest movement over here which wants to stand up for the Australian constitution which a lot of people don't know exists um, they want to have the publicly initiated referendum system and you know many other things they want publicly owned banks as well so what the yellow vest is doing is good and yesterday 19th of January was the first day of um, demonstrations here in Aussie and yeah it looked like the numbers were pretty good and it's just going to keep growing. Now I'm making this video because three years ago when I was really and I still am really frustrated with the world um, I felt like people couldn't understand the same vision that I had about what we could have like people didn't know our potential I wrote a book and that book is called Philosophy Lution is Thought Action Change and the, dis the link will be in the description and in that book I write about psychology I write about education and government systems but I also write about a, a new monetary system as well and that monetary system is called the credit system not to be confused with China's communist tyranny you know authoritarian state social credit system I'll deal with that in another video but not to be confused with anything like that it's totally different because this credit system that I wrote about is a democratic digital economic model with a new type of money embedded within it and the main philosophical principle that their credit system is based around is benefit to society referendums and what benefit to society referendums are is where people vote to create a vision that the system shapes around and it affects everything from what people get paid for their services because in the credit system services are free um, and it affects basically the direction or the direction of the optimization process which is where we scale up and scale down to realize our goals for our society so it gives us a vision to work towards everyone knows where they fit in everyone knows what we're supposed to be doing because right now no one that I know knows what we're doing we're just running on the treadmill you know we're, just, we're going to work we're working the 40 hour weeks we're getting paid we still can't afford homes we still can't afford this that you know everything's a struggle everything's stressful but in the credit system that will change and people will gain a better sense of knowing how they fit into society because they'll understand society's goals and I didn't even know people did referendums like that or, or were going to want that but at the end of last year I published my book and it was just coincidental that when I published my book the yellow vests were starting or had just started and so yeah it's not obviously a coincidence um, this type of thing is meant to be something that we move towards so we really need to push it and it's interesting because everything that the yellow vest want more democracy getting rid of the banks getting rid of the corporations you know no tax free education um, free health care all of that can be delivered by the credit system and so for me 
what the credit system needed because you know I knew that government wasn't just going to implement the credit system and if they did they would probably corrupt it or sabotage it and then say oh look it can't work or twist it to their own advantage I needed a movement of people to begin that would force the government into considering it and so that's what the Yellow movement is and by my reckoning what the yellow vest movement needs is a more coherent vision because that might not be the right way to put it but a vision which encapsulates everything a new system which encapsulates everything um, because just getting concessions within the same system isn't going to make as much change it's going to make some change. It's not going to make as much change as we could get if we implemented an entirely new system which made use of our new technologies, the blockchain, for example. So that's what we need to do. And here in Aussie, we really need to get a lot of momentum, a lot of people. I know more people will keep coming. But if they can see a vision, if they can see, like what I've written in the credit system, I didn't dedicate, like, two, three years of my life to writing that book for nothing. If they can see that there is a system that we can actually move towards, I think more people will jump on board. Because some people are going to be scared because it's change. Um, they might see protesters as rowdy, all that. But if they can see that, no, nah, look, we actually have a really smart plan and system that we're going to move into, that we're going to make the government move into, and we need your help, and we need your help to push us towards there, because once we get that mass of people, the government will have to capitulate somewhere. So that's what I'm advocating. I really want you guys to check out my book. I'm not dogmatic about it. This isn't an ideological thing. I'm not asking for socialism or communism or capitalism or anything. I'm just asking people. The reason I wrote the book was to just open people's minds to the fact that we can do so much more. And I needed the Yellow Vest movement, and they just came along at the right time. And so now I just really want people to check this system out, read my book. If you think that it's going to be useful to this movement, then spread the word. I'm going to go down there, and I'm going to be a part of it, um, you know, when I can. And when I go down there, I'm going to bring some books along as well that I can't sell because they are proof copies. And I'm just going to hand them out to people that want them. So I look forward to seeing you guys down there. Thanks for participating and thanks for being part of that, this movement. Because every single person counts. And you know, I can't wait to meet you fellas. So I'll see you down there.